What is? Baby, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. No more. What is? All right. Cool. That's a nice performance by young Alexander Mann. What's up, guys? If you didn't know, now you know. We are Jungle Beats, Australia's plug to the, um, the quaintest reviews and reactions in the country. If you know, you know. <laughs> um, Scallywag Mascubus. I'm Alexander Sandalis. And we're doing another Unknown Artist Reaction Review. Opportunity to give uh, Unknown Artists a platform to get their music heard and critiqued. Mm -hmm. uh, we have a, this is why we have our Patreon. So if you want us to review your music, you can head on our Patreon and we will review it just like this. 100%. Now. Just like tick tock, click clack, bing bonk. Exactly. A man, Danny, by the name of Aceox on Spotify, he said it's his first rap album. And the thing is, he needs some hard criticism in order to improve. But getting criticism is hard as hell if not a single person even listens to someone's songs. Or is honest with them. Or that. Think you can do that? If you do, be very hard on me. No sugar coating. We will. Well, that's the thing. And also, like, I find a lot of people starting off rapping with the first albums, the only people they show are people close to them. Yeah. And the only people close to them, especially who aren't familiar with music or have, like, a passion for it, aren't normally hugely critiqueable. Because, one, they know the person and want to get the movie better, but sometimes they don't realize that being super positive for someone that's making average stuff isn't going to help them. Like, you got, you got to be hard. Tough love can sometimes be the best love. It's just gotta, you just got to figure out the right time to do it. That's what we're about to do. Thanks for saying that, ACOX. Um, sorry if I'm pronouncing it wrong. We got a first track called Never Ever off his first album, Under Fire. Never say never. Yeah. Yeah. First bar is ever dropped. Yeah. Yeah. Whenever I say yes, you say no. Fuck. I say right, you say wrong. Whoa. Yeah. What the fuck is up with you? You piss me off, you fucking fool. Niggas wanna smoke. Smoke crack no, before? Now they demanded myself and then they come crawling. Begging for forgiveness, they be endlessly no. calling. I don't pick up, cause they can't kiss my ass. No bitches want to ride my dick. No being a rapper is what I wanna be. Shit. No, no one fucks with me. I can't Fuck Bro, you asked for it. Just because you asked for it. We're gonna give it to you. We're gonna give it to you. We're gonna give it to you straight. First, the good though. The production. Production is beautiful. If you produce, you've got a talent. Do that. That, that heavy bass throughout the whole track with the light keys. Beautiful. Beautiful. But that's the good. Th this is. Oh. Mm. Alright. Here we go. This is one of the cringiest songs. I've heard in a long time. The bars on this, the the lyrics on this, the content of this song. Give me a word. Can you give me a word? No, no. Okay, a word. Uh, sand. Fuck you. <laughs> that's not. You relevant. said give me a word. Give me a word that's relevant to how I'm trying to finish my sentence. I wasn't listening. I was, but I zoned out. I'm sorry. What jungle beats? <laughs> like I can start speaking and then you can think about a word. This wasn't a good song, man. This wasn't good. No, and I, I just want to know, like, um, is English your first language? Because I'm picking up a really thick accent from you that sp feels like that English isn't your your native language. Yes, I agree with that. I, I, th I want to hear you rap in your native tongue if, if you have if one. If he has one, yeah. I feel like that if, if English is your second language, and I can understand wanting to speak that language because that appeals to a, a wider audience, I think speak, speak, speak uh, 
who you really are. Because then you'll be able to enunciate, you'll be able to lyrically flow which, with much more um, uh, kind of depth. Like you'll be able to flow better if you can rap in your native tongue. Obviously, it's harder rapping in a second yeah. language. I feel like you need a... Assuming. Know, we're assuming. Yeah. I don't know who you're yeah. recording with. Yeah. I don't know who you're recording with, but I feel like you need to surround yourself with people that want to help you better yourself in a way. Because a lot of the time, you are offbeat. A huge amount of time in this track, you are offbeat. And no, even... never. No, the, the, hook, he, the hook he was on. No, I'm responding. No, never. Yeah. That's what he'd say to you. Like, I don't know how you can be in the studio and be with someone. They're just like, yeah. Yeah, without telling you, hey, man, um, you got to go back to this again again. Because I've, I've, I've done a bit of stuff with Mars, and you just keep going with them, and you, you can get them on beat eventually. And then they, they learn from that shit, but... Like, you were barely on beat this whole track. Uh, your bars are weak. Um, you felt you, like... They're just really simple. They're cringy. They're way too simple. Yeah. Um, it's more humorous than anything. Like, I laughed at a lot of your bars because I found them funny, but I don't think you meant to intend exactly. them in a funny way. I That's thought you, why I think cringe. you actually intentionally meant what you were saying. I think you're coming across a way where... I know, like, the vo your vocabulary on this song wasn't really, wasn't really uh, expanse enough. It was very, yes. It was very, uh, very dense. Uh, and the hook was drowsy, sleepy, and no energy mm. behind it. I do, I will give you this, I do like your voice. Not the way you use it on here at all, but just your tone, your tone of your voice, I can hear it. I can hear it being really good. And I think, honestly, we'll hear from the next few tracks, but like, keep practicing and using your voice to get to a stage where, and ask people around you. Even if you don't know people, put yourself in blogs, like, Reddit, YouTube, whatever the fuck. Find a way to get people to talk to you and be honest with you and just find what works for you. We'll keep listening and we'll see what else we can find. Uh, the next track is called Fuck You. Well, first of all, don't start a track with three, four seconds of silence. Just go in straight with the beat, man. What's the point of that? It sounds dope, I'm sick and tired of people telling me shit Telling me to give up my dreams, get out of my crib Shut the fuck up bitch, I'm not giving in Nobody tells me to do shit, I'm persistent You're unable to listen to what I say You be like, oh this nigga's just a dreamer I fucking kill you, bitch, you're drunk off my meme I'm gonna bring that up, man I said, fuck you, you fucking fly Fuck you, you fucking cry Fuck you, then fuck you You fucking fly Fuck you, I'm too drunk Oh. Once again, the production's good. Just shut the fuck up and leave me be, or I'm a for real cut you up and make you cry. My shit is my shit and not yours. Your emotional body will be found on the shore. Fuck you, then fuck you again. Fuck you until you drop down dead. Fuck you for being a goddamn twat. I really fucking hate you, can't you see? Do I have to kill your whole family just to make you believe that I'm for real? Or do I have to get serious and torture you free? You let me down, me. so I'm a fucking boss and you're just a frog. I can do whatever you say you're just a frog. If I kill you, I won't be fucking caught. I am what I aim to be. Eat the concrete like the bitch you are creep. My what? Seat. I kill bitches, my free time. Your high bright holes, strangle them with chapping ropes. <laughs> oh, bro, you're making me laugh. Oh. I don't even remember the first line. I only remember the last part. What about sucking a girl's dick and hitting her over the head with a frying pan? Sucking a girl's dick? Fuck you, you fucking fly. Bro. I don't know if you realize this, but what you're saying is very comedical. You know what? Maybe that's how it could work. This is, uh, but I don't think that's what he wants to be, though. But it could work. Okay, okay. This is this is we we do not like this. That the the, the, you're, the this, you're not rhyming properly. Um, you're not rhyming a lot of time. Well, he is rhyming properly. He's just not rhyming in a way that is enjoyable. A lot of times, the words he's saying aren't rhyming. I didn't notice that. Towards the start, I can point out a few examples if I listen to it again. Um, Maybe, instead of trying to be some amazing rapper, which you can still try to be, maybe go ahead in the pink guy route and just fucking use this, flip it, and be fucking kind of half satire comedy. Um, but if, if you've also noticed, this is very similar to the first track. The first track was sort of him saying like, people don't believe in me, my dreams be a rapper, 
fuck you, I'm just going to do it anyway. And this track, he emphasizes more on this, but he's just more, but he's more directly just like, fuck you, I'll kill your whole entire family, fuck everything, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, you fucking fly. I'm going to fucking get famous. I think he's got the energy in him to produce something really great. He does. He's got the passion. And the beat here is okay again. I don't think it's as good as the first beat, but it still had it's more that. more like a Nintendo 64 rawness. beat. But seriously, you're, you're still offbeat a lot of the time, but you're very comedical. You don't... I think that's why... Maybe that's why a lot of people... Why you're having all these this anger and, to, and frustration and trying to vent that in this manner because people probably hear your music and you're trying to come across really hard but like really you're coming off very comedical like listen to this sort of stuff i don't i don't get scared i don't i don't feel like you're trying to be the best i i'm just i'm hearing your lines thinking this is this is this is so corny that it's hilarious and that's its own thing in itself yeah but um look also another important thing if you're saying the word nigger and you're uh, not of any type of African descent, or you're not African American, or you're not black. Like a lot of people, are gonna have to take issue with that. You need to be very aware of that, especially if you gain any type of um, popularity. Very it's beautiful. not up to us. Like it's like these. Are the, you yeah. can use whatever words you want. There's gonna be consequences, though. All right, last track. Yep, more. Just in case you want more, got more. I'm enjoying this though. Yeah, it's different. It's fun. It's definitely fun. This could be a hard as fuck track, bro. It sounds so... Like, ooh, spooky, baby. Is either going to be really tacky or really good? Because those those sort of like strings that you're hearing can be real tacky. I was playing the wrong song, so we're not going to get that one. Oh, was that his, though? Yeah. That sounded dope. This is like 10 seconds. You want to listen to more? I fuck bitches on a daily fucking basis So high thinking I can shoot goddamn lasers <laughs> This much <laughs> My bass so heavy it kills your fucking family It's fucking handy for executing freaks Musical murderer at what boss turtles Neutral my tracks and need some fucking birds I fuck everyone and everything We just gave you a little preview of another track called Killer Which had a dope ass beat So we had to listen to it for 30 seconds. I'm running out of goddamn ideas for beats. Running out of fucking oh, lyrics for like my it. tracks. I'm oh, running out of we things can tell. to fucking say. I'm running out of time like goddamn hell. I waste my life doing nothing and it pisses me off. I just want something to do. That's what I have not. Why is life so tiring? I don't understand. Never thought that's how it all fucking ends. I want more, I want more, I want more. More, more, more and fucking more. More tracks, more beats, more stuff. More cash, more more, 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 more! I'm pretty sure he produces. Yeah. By the, by the sound of what he's saying. He's a good producer. Halfway, baby. I'm not afraid to say that I am able to cry and let it all out and still be tired. I'm not an emotionless robot like you, fool. I'm a human being. Doesn't matter if I'm not cool. Sounds like a robot. How come I'm not fucking happy? Shit. I watch the hard and nothing happens, bitch. No one listens to my songs. No one gives a fuck. I mock myself <laughs> like a fucker and then you fucking cock. I want more. I want more. I want more. And we're done. Um, you. Yeah. Uh, we've had the problem with other rappers doing this where they try and speed up their flow to fit it in just before they can make the finish the bar. I know it's had a couple times. That's um, try and structure your rhymes differently so you don't have to do that. Uh, two, you're from Germany. We'll talk about that. Yeah, man, you're from Germany. Rap in German. 100%, bro. You're German, bro. Be German. Don't try and be like every other fucking West Side fucking American rapper out there. I know that's a good way for you to get exposed more. But I don't think it's who you are, man. I feel like you rapping in German would sound so much more dope, especially over these beats. The German language is so aggressive. Mm. It's so raw. Mm. Whereas the English language isn't. I feel like with these type of beats, your the German language would fucking sound better over this type of production. And if you've done these beats, you're a very talented producer. Mm -hmm. You're not a good rapper right now. You can be, but not right now. I don't even I don't know if you even can be. Maybe in German you can be, but I think you should double down on your strengths. You don't need to make the weakness the weaknesses just a little bit better to be weakness to mediocre. Why not make the why don't make your producing skills 
to be great because that seems like that's where you got some talent in. Mm. That they might, they might not be what you want to do, but this, yeah, is, but this is what we're saying. That's why you ask people around you, hey, mm. get some guidance. Um, but to go back to the last track, once again, the production was nice, wasn't amazing. I still like the first track the best. Uh, but you're saying the same things every song. You're constantly really angry. You're constantly saying fuck you to everyone. You're constantly saying I'm, I'm, I, I'm doing what I want to do. He's trying to prove himself. Chip on his way, shoulder. I'm not happy. But like, yeah, it's just like... And he even said it in the track. I'm running out of things to talk about. I'm running out of beats oh, no to make. Shit. It's like... If, you, if you're running out of stuff, don't feel forced to do anything. Like, if you, if, you, if you feel like you're singing the same thing or making the same beat, don't do it. Wait till, you, wait till you're inspired by something to make you do something different that you haven't done before. Read books. Go for walks. Like, do something till yeah. you feel like you have yeah. something different to say. Switch or, it up. Like, life's all about changing, man. So mm. That's great advice. Like, I reckon instead of just being trapped in this, this bubble of constantly making the same stuff and wondering why people aren't listening, it's because you're probably not saying something that people want to hear. Um, but yeah, man, I, I didn't really enjoy any of these tracks. Neither. I enjoyed, I enjoyed the beat the first one. It's not good. Uh, you've got to focus on your rhythm, your constant, your feet. Uh, like I said, I like your voice. I, I do like the tone of your voice. I feel like that either, either in German or with practice, you can make your voice sound really good over this type of production. Honestly, man, I believe in you. You just need a lot of practice and a lot of time. Like the thing with anything in life, you can do anything, but it just needs practice. So you're just going to have to fucking hard work at that shit, man. And who knows? Maybe we'll get good. I, I believe in you, so. Yeah, man. He said it. Rap in German. Come back to us. Hop, hop, hop back on our Patreon and then uh, maybe we'll review that. Mm. There you go, man. No, thank you very much for sending us your music. Yeah. Um, I hope we've been honest enough with you about how we felt and we hope that you can improve in the future because of this. So that's, that's why we do this. We try and we don't mean to be dissing shit on your music. We just want to help you get better. Exactly. And sometimes that requires some tough some, love some tough lo- exactly mm-hmm. Jungle Beats if you want to hear if you want to get your music reviewed and um, shout on you can go to our patreon.com forward slash Jungle Beats <laughs> uh, if you have the courage to like yeah, Ace Lux did shout out to this dude man like he, he said no, yeah, yeah. he said I want you to be as hard as possible and much respect for that yeah huge respect man especially like shout out T Sharon as well we, we were real crit- critical on your music and you took like an absolute champ. And I think that a lot of people can learn from T. Sharon. Yeah. Shout Instead of just Sharon, being bro. like, fuck y'all, fuck your advice, I'm going to do me. Nah, he took it on board. And that's, it. That, that speaks volumes to your character. Mm-hmm. That's you too, Ace Yox. So I hope that you take this as a generally just wanting to help you out. There's a pathway The silver candle shines When you sing Dear Lord, dry martini with a smoking jack When I die, I hope you smoke my ashes See which of my friends could probably roll it the fastest Will it be Ricky, Riley, Brandon, Tony, Joe, Harry, and Memphis?